Hello and welcome to this short uh, presentation, this short tutorial, in which I'm going to show you how to add and change backgrounds in Scratch. So um, open up a new project and then you head over to the right hand corner here where it says uh, backgrounds. And what we'll do is we're going to choose the backgrounds that we want to use first. So you can click here, choose a backdrop. Okay. And um, Scratch has a whole bunch of great images you can choose. So I'm going to choose a few of these, choose the basketball one. And you want another one, you just go back and choose another one. Um, the castle. Okay, and I'm going to choose one more from here. MIT, there you are. Okay, so I've got three backgrounds there. And you can also upload um, backgrounds as well. So images that you've found or images that you've created, you can also add those as well. So I'm going to add a couple of uh, backgrounds here. Um, so I've got a Space Invader background, I'm going to add that one. And I have another Metaverse-like background, I'm going to add that one as well. Okay, so here you can now see all the backgrounds that I've got. Okay, so if you click over here on Backdrops, you can see these are the backdrops or the backgrounds that I have. Okay, so number one is blank, so I'm going to delete that one. And then I have the basketball, the castle, MIT, Space Invaders, and Metaverse. Okay, so we're gonna get now to coding how to jump between those ones, okay? So I'm gonna start with um, using the green flag, the event with the when green flag is clicked. And the uh, links to the uh, backgrounds are all found here in under looks, okay? So switch background to, there we go. Okay, and this is how you can set the one to start with. Okay, so I'm going to start with my baseball one. So when I click the green flag, it goes to baseball. Okay, now there are different ways you can um, make the background change. One way is to like, you know, touch the, the sprite. So I'm going to click on the sprite now, and I'm going to do when, when this sprite is clicked, okay, and I can do next backdrop. So this is quite an easy one to do. So... Uh, start my game again, click the green flag, and every time I click the sprite, the background will change. So that's one way to do it. Nice, easy way. Um, another way you can do, you can add a button. So you might not want to crack, you might not want to be uh, poking the sprite, so you might want to be using a button instead. So I'm going to have the, my button over here, okay, and I'm going to have the code for that on there. Okay, and this is, a, this is a handy little trick you may or may or may not be aware of. So I've already done this code for the cat, but I want to now drag, change it and add it onto here. So you can just drag it right over. Okay, and you can see it's on both now. But I no longer want this if I'm the scratch cat. Okay, so this time, click the button and it will change each time. Great. And then, of course, another way you can always do it is by um, using a key. So let's say when spacebar is is pressed. You can also change the background. Next backdrop. Okay. There you go. Okay. So there you go. Quite simple. Quite easy. Um, of course, you could also do like uh, other events. You know, like when the game finishes, you can switch the game over screen. I have a video about that. Or you know, when you get a certain number of points, you can um, have the background change as well. Okay. So. Quite simple tutorial there, how to add and change backgrounds. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, please click like and leave a comment and check out our other videos. Thanks for watching.